The days of the post-breakup media purge could soon be behind us. And something is fishy about the waters near Santa Barbara. Cody standing by with your news of the weird. Indeed. Okay, this looks like something out of a sci-fi film, but it's 100% real people. It's a okay. gigantic <clears throat> fish, an oversized version of what you expect to see in a small home aquarium. The creature washed up in the beach oh, last week in weird. Santa Barbara. What the heck is that? Turns out the seven-foot fish was a long way from home on the other side of the world, wherever it lived. The strange-looking animal is identified as a hoodwinker sunfish, and it's never been seen before in North Good America. Grief. The marine scientist who discovered the species says only known sightings in modern history have been in Australia and New Zealand, South Africa, and Chile. That is huge. It's huge. Now, they have a sunfish at the Monterey Aquarium, that's big, Not but like it's that. like Not maybe a quarter big. of that size. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that thing's a monster. How did it get there? Right. So weird. <laughs> we'll talk about pandemonium. Suspicious activity in a Wisconsin neighborhood turned out to be barely more than fun. Uh. <laughs> it's a big what? I'm sorry. Teddy bear. Honestly, good. <laughs> Somebody dressed as a teddy bear. <laughs> a woman in Muskego had to run to work, but her dogs needed to be let outside, so she called a neighbor to do it for her. It was still snowy outside, and the neighbor knew the others in the street oh. had security cameras, so rather bundle up, they went outside bare naked. I see what you naked. did there. Uh -huh. uh, the panda didn't want to be identified, but they say he just wanted to have a little fun. Police showed up, no arrests were made. Neighbors are exchanging <laughs> thanks for being so alert. <laughs> if you see something, say something. Why would you call the cops? If Unless you saw a panda? it's a panda. I know. <laughs> and if you're trying to move on from a failed relationship, it's okay. It happens. And there's a website to help you through it. It's called Edit My Ex. Oh boy. Rather than having to reluctantly delete <laughs> selfies and photos of the two of you from all your social media accounts, <laughs> Edit My Ex oh. will do that for you. <laughs> no, we're doing this. They'll remove your scorned lover from them, leaving you <laughs> your smiling face behind. All you have to do is upload a photo that you want edited, right. pay about $12, and about 48 hours, they'll return your photo X free. They also offer a considerable discount for multiple projects, just over $9 a photo for at least four snaps. This is great. Oh my goodness. Ah. Okay. <sighs> I'm, I'm so not throwing shade at Camby, but we could use Camby as the project. I was thinking we the, could. I was thinking the same thing. Yeah. I wasn't going to say it out loud. Good. I, that, I, got, I got it for you. Don't worry about it. We are so close to Eternal uh, Spotless of the Eternal Sun. So what was that? Eternal Sunshine of the Spotless oh, oh, Mind? Oh, of the Spotless Mind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That's basically the plot of that movie. All right. So that's your news of the weird. Back to you. Oh, good stuff. Thanks, Code. 655.